Hi guys, it's Butterfly Bloom, and I hope you're having a great day, night, or noon. Uh, yeah, again, sorry that I'm not posting a lot, but I, but, um, let's just get on to the topic of this video. So I'm just going to be telling you guys what happened in my week, last week, and, uh, yeah. So, last week, it was the, the starting of school again from, um, spring break. And it, it wasn't really a nice start, because for some reason, we got Monday off, too. So, um, yeah, I liked it. I don't really know why we got Monday off, but, um, I just, it was cool. Um, yeah, but, like, th Monday is when we have music. And then Tuesday is when we have P.E. And, like, in P.E., we're learning basketball. And no offense to anybody who likes basketball. I don't like it. Personally, I don't like it at all. Like, my thinking is, when am I going to use basketball in my life? I don't really want to play basketball when I grow older. Um, yeah. But, like, if you want to play basketball, that's you. Do you. Um, yeah. But, like, I didn't really like it. And the fact that, I, like, my legs were hurting that day. Like, the, like my legs were sore from the first P.E. And guess what? Lucky, well, lucky our class, we get two P.E.s. Side to side. So, one day, so Tuesday it's P.E., then Wednesday it's P.E., and then we have a relief of art yay by the way i went to art club and we painted stuff on the wall of our school and it was fun <laughs> but anyways back to horrible pe um yeah so on wednesday when we had to go to pe again this time we have to share pe with the fifth graders so yay another great um another great thing but yeah, so we, so my legs were kind of hurting that day from yesterday. So yeah, but on Tuesday, we were learning how to dribble. And then on Wednesday, we had to actually learn how to like do, like throw, throw the ball through the ho hoop. I think it's called dunking or something. I don't really know. But like, we had to learn how to do that. And so we, so I was trying to throw the ball through the hoop, but um, it didn't really work because I couldn't jump high a lot. I couldn't jump high, like not really, because my legs were hurting. And also I didn't really know how to do it because I wasn't really paying attention because I don't like it. But yeah, um, so I only really got like three chances, like two chan chances three chances to make it in the hoop that did it really well i i didn't do any of the three chances because um uh i never got any of the balls in the hoops let's just say that and um yeah so i didn't like it uh we i love art though so that was pretty neat and like we went camping on saturday Anyways, so let's talk about this toy that I got. It is another one of the squishy yum, squish, squeeze, or squish yum. And there, and it's another one of the jiggly babies. These are small versions of the original. And these ones don't look too different from the ones that I already got, but I think this is the last pack I need to complete my collection. I think I already have all of them. I think. Yeah, so we got, I'm just going to say what I see in the package. We got like this orange thingy. Like this orange, like it looks, it literally looks like the fruit that's an orange. So it has a smiley face on it and ears. Oh, it might be a sea bunny. I don't know why it's orange though. But on the package, it looks like a lemon. <laughs> and then we got another cute bear. We got... Um, a deer that's purple. I have that big version. And we also have... Wait. Uh, 
Okay, and then we got another bear. I think. No, wait. The this one's a dog. Never mind. And then this one's a bear. Then we got a seal. I think. I don't know. It's something cute. It looks like the one that I got last time. Another bunny. And a mouse. I think. Literally, the two different things from my last package were this was is this orange thing that looks like an actual orange fruit and this and the dog and um the seal looking thing yeah but i'm gonna open this and then i'm gonna go get well give me a sec i'm gonna go get my other smushies Okay, um, so let's get into this package. So, uh, yeah. Again, if you want to know the um, where you buy these, I got them at the Family Dollar again. They were la- they were the last package. They're called Squish Yum Jiggly Babies, um, and they're from J. Ja- well, J A. This is all capital letters, by the way. J A dash or slash, I think. R U. Um. I N C dot. I think you just put. I think you could just put um J A dash R U though. So yeah. Um. Uh, and this is not food, so please do not eat it. Or keep and keep it away from heat. Apparently, um, it may stain painted walls, fabric, fabrics, wallpaper, or wood surfaces. Keep away from heat, like I said. I'm just reading the warning. Okay, now let's get into the actual thing. I'm trying not to rip the packages much. So we got the seal. I think this is a seal. And it looks adorable. It looks like a lot like the seal that I got last time. Just this. Or maybe this is an otter. I don't know. I have to research that because I don't really know what either of them look like anymore. This like really weird. This like mouse thing. Or tiger. I don't know what this is. I don't know. I think I already got this one before. Uh, no, I didn't get this one before. But uh, who knows? I might have gotten it before. I don't know anymore. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't think I ever got it. It's not in any of my packages that I have. That I already have. Yeah. So uh, this mouse thing, and then this orange. What is? Oh yeah, I think this is a sea bunny. Like, yeah, sea bunnies are real things. But then again, on the package, it shows that it looks like a lemon. I'm gonna have to count to see how many I already have. I think I might actually have all of them already. And then a bear, a green bear. I think I already got this one too. Uh, I actually might be wrong again. Yeah, I didn't get this one. Uh, well, yeah, I didn't get this one. I do, it has the same shape as this other one, but it's a different design. And then this bunny, I know I had to have gotten this bunny before. I know. If I do not have this, yes, I have this bunny, and I, but it's a different color. It's yellow, and this one's pink, and I actually have this exact same version of this, and big version and it's the same color pink and um let me see let me see and what the oh yeah then we got this duck one i think this is a duck it looks like a duck um yeah so it has like these ear shaped things like these ear shaped stuff on the top it has a weird flake of whatever on it and then it has like blush and eyes and a nose it's adorable and then I have this cow. I have this cow in big version. And uh, I don't know if I actually have this one already too in small version. Yeah, I don't have it in 
this. I don't have it in small version. But I have this cow in big version and it's blue. And it's actually like one of the first ever one of these. I think they're called mochis, mochis or something. I don't know. I've been watching videos and they like, and it says that they're mochis. So I don't really know no more. But yeah. And um, uh, on the package it says they're squish yum. But I don't know. I don't know anymore. I'm just going to call them squish yums or squishy things. But yeah, so I have this cow and big version, and it's blue, and it was actually like my first ever one to start the collection. And uh, that's it. <laughs> that's all the ones that came in the package. Now I'm going to count to see how many I have. And if I have the whole collection, then this is actually probably going to be the first ever thing that I actually finished in a collection. Okay, so we'll start with the packages that we just opened. I have four of these, by the way. Okay, I should make a list. I'll make a list later. Okay, so we got this orange thing. That looks, I don't even know what it is. And then uh, we have the purple cow. I'm pretty sure it's a cow. Yeah, it is a cow. We have the purple cow. Um, uh, we have this little, this the bear thing. We have the bear. Yay, we got the bear. Then we got ah! Then we got the bunny, the pink bunny. Then oh no, maybe I don't have all of them. They're all in different colors, by the way. What? All of these are not listed on the thing though. I don't know how that's possible to get some that aren't even listed on it, but my the dog isn't listed on it. I don't know, maybe they're in different series. Hey. Yeah, so, oh, this one is definitely listed on it. The white, the mouse or tiger thingy. And, um, yeah, that's all I have for this package. Oh, wait, uh, um, I saw this one earlier. It has to be somewhere here. I I think I already got this one. It's just facing a weird angle. I don't know. I think I already got it. <laughs> Let me put them back. And um, I am looking now, and I don't think I actually got all of them. And some of the ones that I got aren't actually put on the thing, so I don't know. But uh, I'll look at that later. I'll look more into that later. And yeah, so I got this like basically on the first week when school started like started where you can actually go inside the school but yeah it's a slinky and i got it at library and everybody got one and i'm basically like one of the only p uh kids that was base that was like able to let their slinky survive like other kids they stretched it out too far and then it oops and then it wasn't able to like do its slinky job and this is the small plastic ones. They're not the metal ones that can go down the stairs. But they're still cool. Yeah. So, um, yeah. Uh, I'm glad I'm, like, I'm glad I was able to make my Slinky survive. So, yay. And then, uh, we have these magnets that I've actually had for a pretty long time. I don't even, like, my mama got me for, got them for me. I don't know where she got them. But she got them, oh my goodness there's like this powder stuff inside of it like this not powder but like i don't know if you guys ever saw this like oh my goodness i can feel the magnetic right here like i can feel a little bit of pull right here but um yeah i don't know if you ever got it i'm scared that that's gonna soon go right there but i don't know if you ever like heard of this but like it's sick. I don't know what it's called, but it's like this metal, like, liquid thing. Like, not metal liquid thing, but it's magnetic. And it's like, when you put a magnet over it, it turns spiky. Like, it turns spiky. And it can climb walls and stuff. And it actually looks, I don't, it actually looks like the, the stuff from the movie Venom. Like, the movie Venom, the black stuff, like, the black stuff. It literally looks like that. Also, I'm pretty sure that's like a PG-13 movie. And I did watch it with my parents. And actually, I don't think I watched the whole thing. But yeah. Ooh. 
But yeah, it looks like that. Except it's not liquid; it's powder. And the more you put on a mag, the more that you put on one of the cube magnets. I got four of these cubes, and like a lot of them have the little like power, like the little magnetic spike things in it. Um, yeah. But like the more of the powder that you put in it, the more stronger it gets to <clears throat> peel them off, like pull them apart. This one, I couldn't even pull it apart at first. Ooh. And if you put your finger between this, um, like while they're like while they're connecting, you could actually cut yourself. But don't worry, I'm always careful with it. And plus, I'm too scared to even put my finger between them because I'm scared that they're gonna hurt me because they're like ah because they're like really strong. But yeah, so those are pretty fun to play with. Anyway, so we have this slime. I actually started playing with the slime a little while ago. Like Sunday, maybe? Or Saturday. And it's like, it's Elmer's Cloud Slime. Elmer's Cloud Slime, I think. It's scented, safe, and non-toxic. It's called New Elmer's Goo. Elmer's Glue. Elmer. Elmer's. Whatever, however you pronounce it. Elmer's Glue Strawberry Cloud. And um, this was like in. I got this in October, so it's probably not so new anymore. Um, yeah, so it's probably like not so new. So, like, I don't think this is their newest slime at the moment. So, yeah. It works better if your hands are moist. My hands are like really dry right now. Anyway, so here is some noise from the slime. Sounds like bubble pops or something. Ah. I really like this slime. It does leave a weird residue, like this weird residue on your hands. But it's okay. I have a blue one that's blueberry scented. It smells really good. Like I think it's, in my opinion, it does smell just a little bit better than the than the strawberry. Just a little bit. But like, um, like, uh, that one is way more sticky. Like it leaves a a bad residue on your fingers. Like you can barely play with it without it like like staining your fingers. Like, you'd always just wash it off. It's not gonna, like, actually make your fingers a different color. But, yeah, it just weirds, like, this weird stuff on your fingers. I'm gonna keep playing with this. But, yeah. So, um, anyways. Uh, our club was fun. I liked it. Um, like, my art teacher, she's, like, the best art teacher, in my opinion. Like, like, she she lets us be creative with my old art teacher like she's the new art teacher and like with my old art teacher though she was she didn't really let us be creative like she would tell us like she would say okay kids today we're gonna be doing like this painting thing and so i want you to make your pen like we i remember this one time we were doing like a watercolor painting of pumpkins for halloween and like um, she said, okay, so you're going to want to do this, and then you're going to want to paint it this color, and you're going to want to do it this face, and then, like, I'll let you do whatever you want for the background or whatever. But, oh, no, I remember what she say. She say, okay, so we're going to do this, and then, like, when the one of the kids would ask, like, okay, but can we do, like, our paintings by our, can we do, like, a painting afterwards by ourselves? And she'd just be like, yeah, yeah, sure, you can do a painting by yourself. And then, like, afterwards, like, we wouldn't have enough time, and we wouldn't even be done with the, like, with the painting, and she'd just be like, okay, so we'll continue this next week. And then, like, I didn't really like her. Like, she was, her personality was nice and stuff. Like, she was nice, but, like, I just wish that she gave us more creative liberty. Or whatever it's called. Like, I don't... 
like her because she was mean to us or something. She wasn't mean to us. I don't really remember a time that she was mean to me. I don't know about other students. But, like, she just didn't give us a lot of creative, like, she didn't really let us be creative with our work. Yeah. Um, but this art teacher, she just gives us, like, we're working with clay, and she just gives us, like, tips on how our clay won't crumble and stuff. But she lets us do whatever we want with our sculptures and stuff. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, I forgot to talk about this one thing. I got these, like, solar dancers or whatever. Like, I don't know what they're called, but you put them in the sun where this, like, little part of it's facing. And they dance or they move. And it's pretty cool. I have two of them. And I really like them. I'm pretty sure I have two. I don't know. I probably... Who knows? I might have more in my closet, maybe. I don't know. I don't really know anymore. But, yeah. Um, I wish I could eat this slime, because it's non-toxic, but it's not good to eat. Please do not eat it. More slime noises. So, anyways, we went camping. And we went, like, camping like I don't know it was somewhere in Arizona I think and it's like like sorry that's just the slime um it was like I didn't really do much because we just went fishing with a, one of our family friends and um I didn't really do much I just stayed in the car because when we got there it was pretty late so I just stayed in the car and went to sleep well went to sleep as good as I could Cause like, I was, I didn't, I don't know. I was, I just couldn't fall asleep, but I fell asleep. I feel like I only got like four hours of sleep though. Cause like I fell asleep and then I'd wake up. I like, I remember waking up and getting this hair out of my face. And I was just like, how come this hair is not getting out of my face? And I grabbed the hair and I was just like, oh, it's my mama's hair. And I was just like, oh, wait, it's my mama's hair. And then I was like, what? How did you get on this side? And then I turned and then I saw someone sleeping in the front seat. And I was just like, what? And then I realized the blankie color, like the color of the blanket. And I was just like, oh, it's just my brother. And then I was like, wait, where's my where's my daddy and then, like i was so confused but i didn't really know anything and i was kind of tired i was like too tired already so i just went back to sleep and then i woke up again because my mama's hair was on my face again so she's like you know what i'm just gonna move your hair and i moved it on top of her <laughs> i moved it on top of her <laughs> and i was just like i don't know no more i i just like I moved it on top of her, and I went to sleep again. And then I woke up because I got really hot in the car. And, well, I kind of woke up because my mom, she went to go check on my dad while he was fishing. I think she went to go check on my dad. Either that or she had to use the bathroom. But, yeah. Um, and, like, uh, I woke up because of that because I heard her opening the car door and leaving and stuff. And I was just like, okay, where are you going? But I, again, I was kind of like, I was at that point where like you were, where you're like, your eyes are closed, but you can hear stuff. And like, it was like, I was just like, okay, I'm going to go back to sleep. And then I went to sleep for another maybe an hour or 30 minutes. And then the sun came up and it was like super hot. And so, well, not super hot, but it was hot. And I, and I don't sleep, I don't really sleep when it's hot. Um, yeah. Uh, so, yeah. So I, so that's what happened when we went camping. And then we went to this really nice restaurant. Like, well, like, it was in, a, um, Boulder City. It's, just, I don't forgot what it's called, but it, I like the theme of it. Like, the vibe and the theme. Like, the theme was country or something and the vibe like the vibe to me it felt very homey like how nice and like if you were at home except there was like these creepy dolls there like there was this like this creepy big doll on one of the 
like they have these shelves where they had like all these cool little like artifacts or I don't know like antiques or something I don't really know what they're called and there was this doll in a rocky chair and like and now that I think about it I would have thought that I would have thought at that moment what if it started rocking but I guess I was just like to focus on eating to think about that but yeah it was pretty creepy i didn't even i don't even think it, that it had feet and then there was another doll on my other side that was like i don't know i don't even know like it had red hair it had like these weird looking eyes like not like it didn't look like those classic doll eyes that you see on an american doll or something it didn't look like that it, they were like they looked like a circle with like three little lines on top for the eyelashes. Then it had a smile. And then it had like like blush, a little bit of blush. And then it had um, a dress. And um, it was creepy. I'm pretty sure that was like, a, I don't know. I don't really know. <laughs> but I'm, I think it's a possessed doll. But then again, I told my brother and he was just like, all dolls are possess- a possessed. And I was just like, okay. So, yeah, other than that, I really liked it there. If they if they had dolls everywhere in that, um, like, restaurant, uh, then I wouldn't really like it. So, anyways, I hope you liked this video. Uh, I'm gonna try and post more. Anyways, so, um, yeah. Uh, I hope you liked this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Bye-bye!